Hello there, once again. And as you can see, I've got my hands on a second pack of these small nice little treasures here. And in this case, it's the number NC215, I think 11. One, one. Uh, once again, one pack made in the USA. Quite normal. I don't think uh, the collector boosters were made in Japan as the drop boosters were. So, yeah. Let's see what we can get from this neat little package. So, first let's open it. Let's get the inside of it here. This is a collector booster, so it's an English version. MGT 2x2. We've got all four pieces, at, or at least theoretically, if I can get them out here. So, one, two, three, four. Neat little package. A little bit uh, interesting why we do have two outer layers. But yeah, still, we do have our four packages. And now let's see what we can get in opening these neat packages. I've got a Frexin Golem. Council of Heroes, Deranged, Supernatural. We are not really interested in the normal foils, so we've got a Terminate, that's a cool thing. Flicker Wisp, Inquisition of Kozilek. We've got a turned over card, interesting. So let's put these over here. We've got two smart foils. We've got a Burning Tree Emissary, that is quite the bent card. Oh, that's interesting. We've got a Wall of Omelets. So, for one file, we've got at first card Tenet the Harvester. Glimpse the Unthinkable. Cool card. <laughs> nice. Etched foil force of negation. Really, really nice. Can. Yeah, I can take this. Uh, <laughs> nice. We've got a Phyrex and Altar. You can just I'll show this uh, in the near future, but for now. Uh, interesting for the force of negation as we once already know it's an american pack so the quality is a little bit below the european and definitely below the <laughs> japanese version still i'd say it's a, a lower near mint out of box uh, rather excellent because of the borders the corners that are already a little bit whited whited spots here uh, when you can see it um, Quite normal, unfortunately, for these cards. But the Frexian Altar also cut quite well. Uh, we do have small whiting on the over border, so quality wise, it's interesting. So, so, yeah, it's also not directly centered, but still really nice altar. Yeah, I can work with that, I think. Second pack <laughs> Force of Navigation, nice. We've got Avon, Ether Snap, Hero, Forbidden Orc card, Sign of Darkness, the normal cards. We've got a Rampant Growth, the Young Pyromancer cool card, didn't have that till now. We've got a Coiling Oracle, it etched, ah, uh, Extended Art Blood Artist. <laughs> oh boy, this is a nice pack. We've got an Imperial Seal in Foil. Mimeoplasm in Extended Art. Uh, Dauntless S card in the Etched Foil. And a Forbidden Orc card in the Extended Art Foil. These ones are nice, but still, put this over here. So, normal Etched Foil, nice Etched Foil, nice Extended, and the normal Extended. And for this one, Quality wise, yeah, well, it's still a little bent because, yeah, it's <laughs> American foil card. But for the quality, can really say this one is quite the catch. So, no whitening, no miscuts, no rip outs or such. So, yeah, this card is a stunner, definitely. Put this over here. Two or four, and we've got a real, really nice, <laughs> a real, really nice pullout right now. So this pack was at 290 euros, 
here in Germany. So I'd say, yeah, we are about it already. Let's see what we can get else. Livewire uh, Lash, put this over here. Thought Scowl, Mentor of the Meek, cool cards. What is it, Boilerwork and Unearth? Up next, Celis. Fun little card. We've got Dragon Lord Dracoma and the extended art, alt art. Nice pull. Yeah, well, that's a mythic. Still, so, put this over here. And Kambal, Console of Allocation. Very nice in the etched foil. This one I'll play myself, so you won't get this in the net. Really, really nice. And I have a Dark and Orrery in foil extended art. So you can see it. This one has a little better quality. Still a light drift side to the right, as far as you can see it. Still, it's looking really, really good. So I can put this on the altar. And now, towards the last pack. I've opened so many things here and I still haven't seen either the uh, cavern nor the uh, toxic extortionist. So let's see. Let's hope for these cards. We've got Heroic. These six cards I'll put it on, the, on the side. We've got a Swift Spear. Spear. Rectus Canarium. <laughs> Once again, pulled over card. Demir Aqueduct, Semi-Growth Chamber, nice. Deathbringer Leash, fun little card, put this down here. Ah, nice, Oracle of Moldaya, we can live with that. Cool card, <laughs> nice. Oh, 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 oh. Oh yeah, that's an edge toil. Nice. Nice, we've got a Ulamog in the etched foil. <laughs> Oh boy, oh boy. So, <laughs> nice. This one, uh, you can see it, 573. These ones are the etched and uh, the, the uh, textured foils. So, we've got a small, nice little Liliana. And yeah, you can see it here. here the, 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 here's the texturing, the texture layer. And oh, nice. This card looks awesome. This is stunning. Nice. I really, really like it. So yeah, I've already uh, prepared the inner sleeves, so they'll just go directly into the uh, into their safe haven after the video. But really, that's awesome. Can't say anything in any way. This this package was simply absolute overkill. So first package uh, with a. Fourth, second Imperial Seal. The third one was uh, rather easy, but the fourth one was simply the, the, the yeah, burned everything away. <laughs> oh boy. Nice, nice, nice. Can only show it to you here like this. Interestingly enough, it's once again the quality of uh, America. So. Right after, out of the box, we do have a, a white small dot here on the other uh, downside. We do have the white dots on this side here. Still looks stunning enough. Here on these corners, we do have a little bit of a whitening. This corner is rather okay. And still, it looks absolutely stunning. Textured foil. <laughs> oh, I love it. Then, oh boy, don't know what to say. This box was simply absolutely overkill. Really, really nice. I hope you had fun uh, watching this. Um, still a little bit, yeah, happy. And have a good time. See you next time.